the king is dead. Long live the king. Well, the uh, king of torts, that is. Melvin Belli, or Melvin Bellicose, as some like to call him. He parachuted into my life in 1995 in New York City. He was 88 years old and commenting on a daily basis on television on the O.J. Simpson trial. He wore cowboy boots and a bordello red lined suit. Took me out for lunch. Shaved white truffles and Dom Perignon at the Oak Room at the Plaza. <laughs> this man transformed the landscape of litigation in the 1940s and 50s. Verdicts went from $10,000 to over a million within a few years because of his use, his innovative, creative use of demonstrative evidence in civil trials. A great trial lawyer, a great author, a great teacher, his legacy lives on in the Belize Society that holds some of the most popular litigation conferences today. When he got a great verdict, he would throw a party in his San Francisco office and go up on the roof, run up the Jolly Roger flag and shoot off a cannon. <laughs> he loved the law. He loved the limelight and he lived them both to the fullest.